TexarkanaFYI.com and Horn Hog Radio. Miss Zena, Jason, Southwest Arkansas. Tell, tell us what's going on. Well, so we work with Southwest Southwest Arkansas Counseling Mental Health Center. They're wearing um, their masks. I felt like I needed to. <laughs> so we had um, Southwest Arkansas Counseling, Counseling Center. and Mental Health Center over yes. on uh, uh, Arkansas, Arkansas Boulevard. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. So this year with the COVID-19 pandemic, FEMA stepped in and said, hey, we need to do something with everything that's going on. We always, you know, any natural disaster that happens, this is a natural disaster. So, hey, what do we need well, to it do? it really is. Yeah. So they stepped in and partnered with SAMHSA through DHS, which they did a Stay Positive Arkansas uh, kind of campaign to, you know, Stay Positive Arkansas. You know, this is a tough time of year um, for folks. Mm-hmm. Anyway, you know, there's there's a lot of mental stress mm-hmm. this time of year. Just the holiday blues, what do they right. call it, you know? Yes. So. Um, you take that and the pandemic together, mm-hmm. and, and yeah, it, it's a it's, it's a, a disaster. It's a disaster. So, so you've got resources. Yes, we have resources. Um, our first, the first thing we want everybody to know is, you know, if you're dealing with stress, you're dealing with anxiety, any disappointment, or anything that's going on that is not normal, you know, we have an outreach where you can call our 800 number, which is 833-933. Eight, uh, two three eight two. One more time, Joe. Eight three three nine three three two three. I'm sorry. <laughs> eight three three nine nine three two three eight two. That's eight three three nine nine three two three eight two. And we also have a stay positive website, which is uh, www.staypositivearkansas.com. Stay positive Arkansas, and it is dot com. Yes. Okay. Um, Jason, you got a big folder and stuff over here. What do you got? I do. Um, I've got everything from. You're going to have to speak up, brother. No, am I not? <laughs> no. <laughs> well, we got these on. Yeah. It does change things. Um, so I've got everything from holiday celebration advice. We have Christmas coming up. People are worried, confused. Um, there's some fear. Um, well, you and, know, and a lot of the experts are, are saying don't gather. Right. Don't, don't gather at all. Right. And with families and everything, you know, some people like me, I come from a large family. Uh-huh. And so usually it's 40 to 50 of us together. Well, this year that's not going to happen because of the pandemic. So, sure. you know, it'll just be me and my girls this year, you know, things like that. Even for Thanksgiving, we didn't have big gatherings. We right. just kept it small. It was six. Right, but and uh, you know which, I've still got leftovers because of that because right. I've, I've never had to cook for such a small Thanksgiving right. before. But, but um, one good thing that comes out of that though is the ability to if if you're if what gets you in the Christmas spirit is cooking for a lot of people, and and I know my mom's one of those people that that wants to cook for forty and there's going to be three there. Mm-hmm. Um, <laughs> Now she's still cooking what she wants to cook because that puts her in that that place that she wants to be where it feels like Christmas. Right, it's um, her it's her routine, it's her tradition. Right, and she's able to box those up um, where they live is a, a community of, of people closer to their age uh-huh. um, that are also probably not going to see family coming in, so they can go around and share what she's cooked. Oh, that's great! Leave it on doorsteps, give them a call. Hey, you've got a surprise outside, and then. You know, keep that going on, and then it, it lifts other people's spirits. Well, and so it's, it's finding small things that you can do for other people within your means um, to kind of help uplift everyone else. That's awesome. Yeah. Right. You, t- t- tell your mama where I live. I'm a- <laughs> <laughs> we also um, be careful where you for step. For Christmas, right? be careful where you step when you walk <laughs> when outside. When you walk outside, because you might have something there. <laughs> oh, um, that's pie. <laughs> yeah. So we also have um, a Facebook page. Uh-huh. We have a Instagram page, a Twitter page, and it's all Stay Positive Arkansas. Okay. Um, so we do have. And are those. we hashtagging Stay yes. Positive Arkansas? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes, we are. What? Well, uh, do you guys have trouble? We're out at Rocky Creek. It's my clubhouse. What do you think? It's Love nice. it. It's nice. <laughs> got, got really it. nice here. <laughs> well, thanks for coming out here. And uh, uh, if if you need anything with what you guys are doing, you know, we'd love for y'all to use this place anytime you want. Thank okay, you. thank you. you.
do so much for the community, but you've got, there, there's resources beyond just, just mental health. Yes, we have, um, for those parents who are having trouble, you know, getting your kids' attention, um, things like that, we do have like a free online printable coronavirus books that teach the children about the coronavirus. Mm -hmm. This one we had, print, had printed out already. I printed it out just to give, you know, when I'm out. Dave just, the dog is worried about coronavirus. Mm -hmm. A nurse body book. So it just kind of goes through. You oh, know, that's great. Was that somebody here that did this? Um, no, it was uh, one of the ladies in the we Arkansas could, in the. Uh, It'd be Little nurse body. Yeah. <laughs> or a little rock, um, area who um, come up with the idea for the book. Oh, that's fantastic. So we do have an online um, thing for these books if anybody interested. Would, would that also be at staypositivearkansas.com? Yes, sir. The resources, it will, it will be on there on the resource uh, section of that. And, and as far as uh, here, here locally and, and the center over on Arkansas Boulevard, how could someone get in contact with you if they just... Um, we maybe maybe they're overwhelmed mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, this time of year mm -hmm. COVID everything together mm -hmm. they just they just want somebody local to talk to how, how would they go about getting on with you today? Um, if they wanted to talk to one of us uh, we have uh, cell phone numbers um, that they can call um, my number is 903-733-0963 um, Jason's number is 903-733-1119, oh, and then Ricky's, um, I can't remember a phone um, number. I, <laughs> I really can't. I have to. We, yeah, we have another co-worker, Ricky, who's not here. Her I want to, I, I just want to, uh, I want to say how much I appreciate your dedication to what you do. It's not a lot of people that would go out here and, and give out their phone number. Right. You know, call me directly. Yes. But but give those numbers one more time. Um, 903-733-0963, and 903-733-1171. It's a it's a tough time of year for everybody, and and um, there's a lot of folks that are willing to to just talk to you, let you yes. know. I mean, there's a lot of folks that are that are going through the same thing that you are. Mm -hmm. um, it, it, don't be ashamed in any way to no. reach out. I mean, and that's and that's what we're here for. And, and, you know, it doesn't matter. And, and there's just so many times, and I'm, I, I just want to put this out there because I know there's so many times that folks will make an effort to reach out, mm -hmm. but the person that they're reaching out to may not may not be know receptive. of the resources right. or know know how to respond. Right. And, and I just want them to know that there are people that you can contact and they will make sure that you're taken care yes, of. Yes, and you know, whatever we can't help them with, um, you have the we resources. have resources to give them to, you know, get to where they need to be. We have other, I mean, we have plenty of resources. We have a list of food pantries that are in Miller County, because we cover nine counties. Mm -hmm. We cover Miller County, Hempstead County, Little River, Sevier, Howard, Hempstead, Nevada, Nevada. Mo most of Southwest Arkansas. Yes, most of Southwest Arkansas. Um, we do have clinics in most of those Southwest does, but a lot of them, some of them are out of our catchment area, but we're still trying to help anybody that's in Arkansas that listens or hears this. You know, if we can't help you because of where you are, we can get you in touch with the right people that can help you in your area. Right. So we do have all those. Well, I, I I thank y'all so we do, I almost have time here. I thank okay. you so much for coming. Um, uh, again, the hashtag if you can't stay mm -hmm. positive Arkansas. Arkansas. Um, get involved with that if it's not uh, needing someone to help you lift your spirits. Just you sharing something positive with that hashtag right. would go a long way just it for will. the movement. Let's let's stay positive. Yes. So thank you so much. Do I have one minute? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, since we were talking about sharing. Um, I just wanted to let you know that um, Southwest Arkansas Counseling Mental Health off Arkansas Boulevard yes. is having a red beans and rice fundraiser um, for their Jefferson House. Um, it's an outpatient. Red, red beans and rice yes. fundraiser and for the, the plate, Jefferson yes, House. Yes, the plates are seven dollars. So when, when get, is this? This is Tuesday, um, December eighth. Tuesday, December eighth. It's mm -hmm. red beans and, and rice. Red and beans rice. and rice, grilled chicken, grilled chicken, French bread. Yeah, that you'll get $7. a plate with dessert at seven dollars. Where will this be? Um, at? This will be at the address there. It's uh, 2904. No, it's thirty nine oh two. 
the Jefferson House. It's 3902. It's behind the Jefferson House. Is the building next to Southwest. But if you go behind down Sanderson Lane, uh -huh. um, it'll be the building at the back of Southwest. That's where they will uh, give the plates out. Oh, okay. I know exactly what you're you can, talking about. Yes. The, 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 Sanderson I was thinking Lane Sanderson then, going into the neighborhood, but we're talking about Sanderson. Sanderson. And they then, can, yeah. yeah, and you make that turn right there, and then they're, you know, they're right behind there. So you can you can call and and schedule for a plate, you know, or you can well, just I show get up some, and buy Will you plate. send me an email on that I later will. today? I will. I definitely right. will. We'll give a, an air fist bump right. <laughs> and an air hug to Miss Z. <laughs> My daddy good. said hug all the girls. Okay. <laughs> Always hug all the girls. Right. right. Thank well, you all so much. Thank you so much, Thanks Jeff, for having us. I really appreciate your, you know, time and Getting okay. back to me so quickly and getting this set up. Uh, any, we're any, just trying to keep everybody positive. That's exactly right. Anything we can do to, to keep everybody's spirits up. There's Bruce again. Yes. Do, you see how the dogs just come in and out out here at the clubhouse? Eh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's the way it should be. <laughs> All right. Thank you all for coming thank out you. here. Thank you. We appreciate you.